Okay, so let's take a look at how to install ZAMP. As we discussed, ZAMP uh, basically is the Apache web server, MySQL database, um, PHP, and, uh, and Perl. Uh, so I'm at the ZAMP site. You can get here, just do a Google search for ZAMP. It'll be actually the, uh, the first thing that comes up. Um, and I'm just going to scroll down here to, uh, to ZAMP for Windows. Okay, so when I click on that, uh, basically takes me to this page. Now from here, again, we're going to scroll down a bit. And what we're interested in, recall, is the ZAMP USB light. Okay, you definitely want this because you want to install it um, on your USB drive, your flash drive. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and click here, and it gives me all the different options for uh, the various things that uh, the various ones that I can download. Um, you can certainly download a zip file. I tend to like 7-zip. Uh, that does require it. You're going to have to Google 7-zip and install it, but either way, that's fine. Um, so you can download those uh, and uh, and save it to your to whatever location you want. Um, eventually, you'll need to then extract that, uh, preferably to your desktop. Okay, so now if I uh, come here, uh, you'll see I have ZAMP, the extracted ZAMP sitting on my desktop. Okay, once I've extracted it here, what I'm going to do is, uh, is that I actually want to put that onto my flash drive. So here's my flash drive here. Now I'm just going to drag this over onto the flash drive. Now, depending on uh, on this is actually a really good test of uh, of your uh, of the speed of your your flash drive as well as uh, as your USB system. I happen to be using one of the uh, one of the faster uh, flash drives. These uh, these uh, Patriot X XTs. Um, and so, even in my case, it's going to take probably around three minutes to do so. Okay. So uh, thanks to a little movie magic, uh, real time that took me a little, a uh, little over three minutes. As I said, depending on your system, depending on the version of USB, I was using USB three there. Um, you know, it can actually take upwards of uh, of twenty minutes or more. Okay, but you only have to do this this copy once. Once you get it on there, then it should actually be fine. Now. Once you, uh, once you put it on your flash drive, then what you're going to need to do is you're going to go to the ZAMP folder itself. And you're going to scroll down towards the bottom here. And you need to run this setup ZAMP.bat. Okay, this is going to set all of the scripts so that it knows where ZAMP is installed. So I just double click this. You'll see uh, a window that looks like, uh, like the following. Basically, uh, kind of runs everything. And once you see your have fun, fun with Apache friend ZAMP and press any key to continue, go ahead and hit a key. You're all set to go. Okay. At this point, you can go to, uh, to zampcontrol.exe, double-click that. That will open up your window that looks like this. Uh, go ahead and click Start for Apache. Um, now I'm getting a Windows security alert, so I'm actually I'm going to allow this. That's fine. Um, it will ask me for my, uh, for my password, for the administrator password. Um, then I'm also going to install, uh, or sorry, I'm going to run MySQL. Okay, MySQL is running, so I have both of those running. Um, again, getting my little security alert, so I can go ahead and uh, I'll click Allow Access once again. Um, so now that those two things are running, I can uh, go ahead and check what's going on with that, make sure that it is actually running properly. Namely, I can go here to localhost. Um, when I hit enter, so when I first start up ZAMP, it's going to give me the option to, uh, to choose which language. I'll choose English, and I should see uh, something like this. Again, I can go to PHP Info to check, uh, check how everything is running there. Um, I can also run PHP MyAdmin to, uh, to verify that that's working. Again, PHP MyAdmin, the first time you run, it defaults to German. Um, just come into here, and you can... Uh, change that to uh, to English and you should be all set to go.